Hi guys, um, happy hump day. So I wanna do a quick follow-up video on the really bad curb rash that I got on the left-hand side of my car, both rims where the renter totally denied it and just straightforward lied about it. But what does it matter anyways if you have proper check-in and check-out photos? So just a few things to note, make sure that you upload your check-in photos within 24 hours of your trip start and your check-out photos within 24 hours of the trip ends. And one thing that I've been really heavily focused on lately is really pushing my renters to make sure that they do the check-in and the check-out process because even for you as a host, that gives you a secondary set of photos as backup in case you ever need them. And it also gives the renters a peace of mind that they took those photos and so that they have proof for themselves of the condition of the car before and after. So this happened Saturday night, which was the 9th. Then we went into Sunday, Monday was a holiday, and Tuesday the 12th, I received the payout for the claim, so it was rather quick. Um, the total amount was about $282, and I have an appointment for this car tomorrow where I'll take it into my shop, and this is for just a repair of the rims, with, which is usually the case. Man, I can't talk today. <laughs> um, so hopefully they'll repair it. If it's anything more than what Turo has already paid out, then my shop will just simply file the supplement, which I've done a bunch of times before. So nothing that I'm worried about there. Um, so yeah, that's basically what happens quick and easy. And while I'm sitting in this car, I also realized that a long while back, I did a video on the major accident that happened in this car and I haven't done a follow-up, but obviously it's in working condition and it's back on rentals. So everything did work out, but it was very interesting because it had so many elements to it. So this week I will do a follow-up video on that and break down for you guys exactly how everything took place and how long that it took. So that was really interesting. And always guys, um, you know, I'll always report on things exactly as they happen to me. Um, you know, I can only talk from my experience of doing this and what I have proof of and what I have facts of. And so I'll always report on the good and the bad exactly as I experience it. So thanks for watching, guys. Leave me your comments and your questions. And as always, I'll do my best to get back to them as soon as possible. And if you enjoy this channel, please be sure to subscribe so I know that you guys are enjoying what you're seeing. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a great rest of your week. I hope you guys have killer weekend with rentals and that you all just crush it out there. Bye guys.